welcome back to my channel i hope that you guys are doing good i thought that i just wanted to make this video for you guys to kind of compare the alpha lead amplify leggings in the size s and the amplify leggings in the size m i have previously made multiple videos of the amplifies although they were on my old channel so therefore you can't really find any of those videos on this channel I have really been torn between an S and M in the Amplify leggings so many times and as they are quite expensive you just don't really want to buy M just for the sake of it and just to like try it out but I actually decided to do that a while ago just because a lot of people were saying that especially from this launch where they like released the pastel colors like the misty lilac and all those type of pastel -y pastel colors a lot of people said that that fit was quite tight and they recommended you to size up so i decided to order these misty lilac leggings in the size s and then i also have like the the pink ones i can't remember what they're called but i have them as well in the size s and then i ordered the hazelnut in the size m so today we will be comparing these misty lilac leggings to the hazelnut leggings in the size m and these like i said size s so when i ordered these leggings i was actually five kilos heavier so it has taken me a while to film this video but i can also speak from the experience of actually weighing 64 kilograms versus now 59 kilograms so today currently i'm weighing 59 kilograms and uh, today i can just say that wearing the s is definitely a lot nicer than wearing the m but 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 in winter time when i weighed five kilos more i would definitely choose the size m because that was just so much more comfortable and now before we get into the details i kind of just want to say that i have a very short torso which also is a little bit of a problem for me because like if we look at the amplify leggings it's, it is supposed to be like compressive around your tummy but for me it kind of starts up here on my waist almost so where we would want these to sit would be right around here to kind of keep that tummy control but as it is for me when i pull them up where they are basically supposed to be this is how they look like <laughs> like they come quite high up and yeah i don't i don't really like that to be honest so that's why i usually always just roll them down but now let's get to the details of the fit so overall i feel that these are super stretchy i mean the waistband is quite compressive but i would not say that it's like too compressive i am still quite happy the way how it sits and feels let me back up a little bit just so that you guys can see these leggings a little bit better now there is a little bit of bunching right up here and the reason for that is basically because obviously i hike my leggings up to really get that scrunch in the middle i don't want it to be hanging down here somewhere and then it's gonna rip <laughs> so yeah there's a little bit of bunching right here but it's not that i really care too much i mean i don't think it looks too bad and also as i am short this is just something kind of what i have to deal with but yeah so overall today being 59 kilograms i would choose the size s over size m just because they are stretchy they're not too compressive and i don't like my leggings to be like super compressive like i don't really need to feel snatched in as some people are really like passionate about they're like i need to feel snatched in like no that's not me i don't need to feel snatched in but i also don't want them to hang like a pair of joggers <laughs> so yeah so now we are wearing the hazelnut in the size m and i would say that the main difference is that the waistband is less compressive that's like the main difference I can of course feel that the fabric around my glutes and around my legs I have a little bit more space but I can also feel more bunching like more bunching around here and also from the back I think you guys can see that there is a little bit too much fabric like yeah I mean I can definitely wear both I feel like if I if I put the waistband up though this is how it looks like <laughs> and this is just too high up <laughs> no thanks like i said main difference is that waistband 
less compressive, more fabric around the glutes. I mean, they feel more comfortable, they do. So I, I suppose it really depends how you feel like. Like I mentioned earlier, when I was five kilos heavier, I would choose the M every day. Like the S was uncomfortable to wear. Right now, as I am five kilos less, I would choose the S just because the S feels like the M, what it felt back in winter. Now these feel a little bit too big. I will obviously still wear these. I don't think they look as flattering as the S, but they still feel more comfortable. They do. So in terms of like working out, maybe M is just better. I don't know. In terms of looks, S. I mean, it's not that they look bad. I think it really just comes down to preference, to be honest. Do you like to feel sucked in and held in or do you want it a little bit more looser or yeah i don't know i mean one good thing is definitely that the waistband is not digging in and that's nice because i don't want to feel that the waistband is like digging in when i work out i mean now i would say that it doesn't really dig in too much on the s but like on the m it definitely doesn't dig in like yeah it feels comfortable more comfortable to squat and I also experimented with the sliding down because I was running in both leggings in the gym I would say that these slide down maybe just a tiny bit more I mean usually the amplified they sit so you don't need to do anything you don't need to adjust them after when you've been running or nothing they just sit where they sit these ones I maybe just needed to do like a little and then I was done so nothing too much they still don't like like they don't slide down they don't but i just needed to adjust them a little bit after a run so my conclusion is like i said it really depends on what you prefer i think you could go both with an s and an m but i would say if you're in between sizes size up i mean it's it's nice to be comfortable you don't want to just look good and be sucked in like no it's nice to actually feel comfortable i think also by feeling comfortable you will have more confidence because if you feel that everything is just too tight and you can't breathe and everything is uncomfortable you're not gonna feel good in the gym when you squat down and you're like oh my leggings are digging in like nobody wants to feel that way so I would definitely say go with the comfort. If they could just make a leggings that it would be between S and M, imagine like S slash M. Perfect. With that said, I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe and like, and I will see you guys in my next video. Until then, take care. Ciao, ciao.